them a come, we a give them fire All of my guys, we a leave them higher Like, how do I get this Emeka guy and rope him into rope him into this thing? He's not going to agree. What do I do? What do I do? You think I'm that cunning? Yes, yes. <laughs> In fact, I do think you are very much. Oh, that this is the place. It looks so lovely. <laughs> Morning, family. Happy new vlog. <laughs> well, today's vlog. Welcome to this week's vlog. No seriousness. This guy is distracting me. Wow, Mr. Face Mask himself. Anyways. Today we're going apartment viewing because as I've told you guys I'm moving to Lagos and my sister and I were gonna get a bigger place So we're here to view and Bay is here with me. How are you feeling Bay? Feels roped into this <laughs> Gee cool down now. You're just moving like <laughs> Thank. Okay, so yeah, I'll take you guys along I actually remember when they, I, I do remember my office is down yeah. there. I actually remember when they started doing this place. Oh, hello. I'm already liking the place. Oh, the kitchen is smallish. Oh. I'm very happy though that it's a standing shower. I don't like bathtubs. Is it like this in all the rooms? Yeah, all okay. Okay. Uh, uh, is it solar powered or just this one? Okay. I would have thought that was very cool though. In the second about two months that will be gone. Yeah. Uh, uh, this is my room now. Oh, come on. This is my room. My guy. Can you even know your room? Can you come out of my room? You can come out too. Yeah, you can. Whew. You have to see yourself in it. It's not a matter of spray or room. What was that? What was the rent? I didn't hear that. 4.5. Okay. Yeah. Then services. No service. Okay. Oh, you service by yourself? Yeah. Fair enough. Wow. How can my slippers cut during the viewing? Thank you. Me, I was already sold on that first place. My eye look is sold. But, yeah. Um standing shower balcony my own separate floor what more am i looking for in this place okay what do you have to say sorry sorry <laughs> slippers caught in that last place i don't know if that was god telling me i'm supposed to be there so i'm wearing a nice shoes uh oh covid checking i like yeah. that uh, uh, we pull well, not really, but some cool, no? some sort of pool. <laughs> it's a lovely size. Funny enough, that's actually a good size. Pool. That is a space. This is tight. It's tight. It's just, well, is that pantry? Yeah, there is. Behind there. But this is very nice, yeah. Is it standing? Oh, yes, it is. Love it, love it. Yeah. We're matching today. Why are you looking so angry? Somebody will think you're depressed to be here. I'm actually having a great time. Can you imagine? <laughs> It takes more than intellect to be a musician. Put your soul in 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 soul in
So, I found these questions on a blog called 4C Nappy Hair and it's called the natural hair tag. 20 questions. Your shirt is white. Are you holding it? You can't see it in that background, shop for shop. Am I holding it? <gasps> yes, I am. I can kind of see. Yeah, like it's pure like white. It is mad. Wow. Good morning family, how are you doing? <sighs> Today is officially the beginning of a new week. I know I started recording yesterday. Or oh, does the week start Sunday or Monday? I don't know. It feels like Monday because Monday is when work is. Wow, see my eye. Sorry. I just woke up clearly. It's 7.30 but i'm meant to be working out with my neighbor he lives he literally lives like 10 minutes walk but i've been stuck in the rain because of rainy season so i'm like let me just be driving because i don't want to be stuck there and today i have a lot of work today is officially the day that the wrong gas relief campaign starts um thank god for that so you know i have a lot of work to do to just make sure that all the graphics get out on time campaign is for people who covid has impacted their lives were given away um a total sum of 450,000 naira for free all you have to do is just share your story i'll leave the link in my description box because the giveaway will still be open by the time you see this vlog it's going to be open for two weeks we're trying to get as many people as possible and of course please if you know someone that needs it can you also tag by the way i hate that i'm having this conversation with the bonnet on my head but as you saw yesterday i did this new hairstyle and i'm still in between filming my natural hairstyle my natural hair video if you haven't seen that please go and watch it the sweat on this bonnet right now i just have to take it off so it can dry i don't want my hair to wet to stay wet as you can tell i'm back home oh my struggling with his breakfast you eating good job i could need to do work okay yes i could need to do work oh oh my god a black eye did you show them your black eye <laughs> my cutie my cutie yeah baby trying to film i don't even know how i can do this wow oh this is the house this is my makeshift backdrop it's a house it's a house, it's a house. okay i can still film a video what uncle you know watch blaze again no i could need to work i could need to film a video no uncle no take him move i can take the move okay i'm holding the remote and what me what play hey uncle this is the move this is the odd voice i have gotten comfy legs on uncle no bless you say you should do watch blaze right now no watch blaze Oh my god, oh my god. Eh? We filming? No, I could not. No, no, no. See? No, I could not. No, see? See? Look who is that? And get the dog. Come on, stop shouting. You're shouting at Aku on camera. No, I could not. I'm not. 
I am sorry, sorry. Okay, you leaving? See you, mm -hmm. baby. No. Right, let's go. No. Who's walking? No, 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 no. No, no, no. Once again, I will ask, how do people with children film? <laughs> okay, y'all, quick outfit change, and then I'm going to film the COVID video. I also need to change this backdrop. How did COVID change your life? Did COVID change your life? How did the COVID-19 pandemic change your life? How did COVID-19 change your life? If you're willing to share your story, then we're here to help. The Rongas Group, in collaboration with the Butterfly Effect Empowerment Initiative, have provided a 450,000 Naira monetary fund to give away to applicants who are able to demonstrate how COVID-19 impacted their lives and how the money will be able to transform their situation. So make sure you send this to five people who need to see this and click the link below to enter the giveaway. Be sure to follow Rongas Group and B Initiative for more updates. Okay, life of a content creator. So, hey, I hope that was not in my video. Well, now I'm off to meet my friend. He wants to go shopping for a present. I'm not sure if he's gonna let me vlog, but you know, that's what I'm doing anyways. Okay, y'all, I'm here. Oh, y'all shouldn't ask me how I ended up at the construction site. That's all I'm When he called him, I called him as a prophet. He already had an excuse and said that he was too young. That he, he said he um he did not know how to speak since he was only a youth. So he already had that first excuse that or maybe God should come at another time because he was just young. And you can imagine a young those excuses get the better of him because he did not decide that oh he was today um mm, tomorrow or mm, this is not the right time because he decided okay the time was right and time was dead then which is why today he's still celebrated so i just finished my prayer group got ready for bed and all and um decided to come check in Today something happened. By the way, I wish I could have taken you along with me today. Aside from going shopping with my friend, we also went to one of the construction sites that he's working on. And honestly, like I learned so much today and I just wish I could have vlogged it. But then, you know what? Something phone is ringing. Something else happened. Okay, sorry about that. But yeah, um, something else happened today. So, you know, I did learn a lot doing all of that, understanding site development and construction and glass that millimeter and diameter and whatever. I shall have a deeper understanding of like construction sites. And I've, I've, I, in my mind, I was thinking, it's so interesting that I get to see this because I'm not in a position to be able to buy land, to be able to build you know i haven't gotten those opportunities yet so that's something that i've never even considered i've never even thought oh what goes into building a house and you know just because i was accompanying my friend and following him around i was able to see all of that so it was really interesting i wish i could have shared but then it's not everything you experience that you're meant to share or that you're able to share as a vlogger i'm learning that because um it turns out that today i also received a message from the people I did um, the bunny vlog with if you check my bunny vlog has now been deleted because the company was not happy about the fact that I you know 
vlogged about it and the thing had reached 10k views and they had received a lot of comments about the vlog and stuff so i had to delete the vlog because as i said i even explained in the comment section that day that i was um you know the, my my video was a bit shaky because i wasn't trying to make it obvious i was vlogging and it came around to bite me in the butt so you know i feel like this vlogging thing is interesting that my 100th vlog was titled keep going because literally today in fact technically this is my 100th vlog because my 67th vlog has been deleted based on privacy and based on respecting other people's boundaries and you know so now this is my 100th vlog so keep going but you know i also need to learn how to be strategic and more I don't know the word but i don't know what should i have done in that situation i knew if i was going around telling everybody hey i'm vlogging they would have stopped me from vlogging i wouldn't have been able to share those things people would have never heard about bunny people would have never heard the things i shared in that video but then look it came back to bite me in the butt and now i had to delete the video after all my efforts what in other news look at this my clothes tags just arrived I'm so happy about this fly made in Nigeria. I feel like B Fly is the name of my brand, but somehow it's moving towards fly because B Fly is just a play on butterfly. That. that made me happy. I also got my package from my tailor, but I don't think I'll try them on till tomorrow so that I can do like a mini try on haul for you guys. By the way, I know my skin ended on a weird note in that vlog. <coughs> Ooh, hiccups. By the time I woke up the next morning, like obviously all the redness had cleared and then these two pimples even went down. But then I'm now getting like some small, small pimples. Honestly, <laughs> where is this coming from? <gasps> but honestly, I'm over it. So I'm not complaining about my skin anymore. <laughs> Till tomorrow. I just finished getting dressed. I was trying to film like a bit of a wash routine. There's still conditioner on my hair so that I can add it to my natural hair video. But I also got my Be Fly deliveries. Yeah, anyways, there are some things I have to take back because still more alterations, but at least these ones are ready. I can't wait for you guys to see it. I also need to go to the bank. Yes, that's something I need to do today. And I haven't been to the bank since this whole corona thing started. Uncle. Yeah, Oma. Um, uh... Uncle. Uncle. Yes. Yeah? Have fun. Have fun? Which one is have fun? What's that? the <laughs> bank. Oh, you want to lie down? Okay. Okay. Okay, that Apple. Okay, where should we lie down? Thank <laughs> you. 
It's a camera. Yes, I got it. Oh my god, you won't see what I go through before I get my videos out. <laughs> okay, Omar, please don't tear it. It's okay. Please, please, please. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Okay, so this is at least good enough for me to go about my day. I'm learning to stop vlogging and driving. Sorry about the noise. But yeah, I'm learning. So yeah, thanks for all your feedback on that, to be honest. Sometimes the struggle for content is just deep. So, um, I'm just at the filling station now, filling up my tank. Eh? When they change the light, the thing goes off, apparently. So yeah. I just wanted to show y'all. They reached out to me on Instagram with like two dresses, so I'll try them on when I get back home because I'm just going out to the bank and then I'll head home so I can rinse my hair before the lady comes to make it. She says she'll come at like 2.30 and it's currently 12.26. Well, I know my mom and all the mom and dads on YouTube are about to come for me for not wearing my mask. Sorry about that. Price has changed. When? Ah, it's over two minutes now. Wow. Don't make you know the price before. They now rise it up now. How much is it? It's one for the for eight now. Before it's one for one twenty. Oh wow. During the COVID, they brought it down. The COVID, okay, they brought it down. Okay, makes sense. This is your cam this is your camera. Yeah. Get us a view. Ah. <laughs> You don't like him, but you like him. Like <laughs> Thank you. Very brilliant. You it's like Sony. picture? It's Sony. Yeah, this one is Sony. Very bright. How much the charger costs? The camera costs. He said if he had five hundred dollars, he would build a house. <laughs> wow! Can you build a house with five hundred dollars? Or do they just think five hundred dollars is worth more, much more than it is? All right, I'm off. So I'm just leaving the bank. A few points to note. Um, I went to withdraw cash as well. So yeah, a few things to note. Take your own pen because you don't want to be sharing pens. And then secondly, when you're withdrawing, they'll ask you to take off your mask so that they can like verify your identity. When the guy asked me to take off my mask, I'm like, ah, in this corona, I thought he was trying to run me or something. Okay, y'all, I'm back home in time for... Lydia to do my hair. I still haven't washed my hair though, so that's gonna take a bit of time. But she's mixing the attachments. And yeah. I wanna see what Lady Diva sent me. I'm in love. I actually told myself, let me just try it on the keeper. I need to show you guys because I don't know when I'll actually take the pictures.
six more than the other. Smack. Put your soul in. Okay, I have a phone interview with a journalist from BBC who wants to talk about like cases in Nigeria. Uh, I've been following and looking into a number of great cases in Nigeria and I'm particularly interested in doing a piece looking at uh, women who have reported uh, cases of rape and mm -hmm. have then faced intimidation or violence either from the police or from the community um, after reporting. Um, I think it's really important to show that this happens to try and put the stock to it. Today's a bit of a sober day. I'm going for my cousin's funeral. So, you know, I was just trying to explain to you guys that there are no restrictions on the number of people that can be at funerals, so it's only 20 people. Um, and while I was saying that, my sister now asked if I was vlogging the funeral, and I said, yeah, just obviously just bits, I'm not vlogging everything. And she said, oh no, it's, um, it's a private moment, so I shouldn't, I should ask their permission first. Um, which I understand but you know it's reminding me of what I was kind of talking about when it came to the um, Bonnie trip that I had to delete the video because they too felt that it was a private project and I shouldn't have shown all of that so I don't know what to do I don't know what to do I feel like you know this vlogging thing is kind of a dilemma as well because of course I want to share and take you guys along with me and I try not to like share too much of what other people are doing or share too much of other people's private information but then where do I draw the line in sharing my own perspective and you know other people I just came sit on the balcony but bruv clearly it's a bit too hot so I'm gonna have to go back in but yeah I don't know like I wish there was actually a proper vlog community so that I could discuss this with like fellow vloggers like so how do you handle it like if you're going for a funeral now obviously I was not about to start showing you guys her body but simply even telling you guys that I'm at the funeral should I be keeping that private I don't know <laughs> I got 